Hi, my name is Marina Kozmenko and I am a founder of PTO. And now the second part of this video, I also want to show you how to use uh, the leaf area meter in PTO Pro in this field condition because we, can, uh, we got a lot of requests from our customers who are interested about real-time measurement but in the field because it's very easy to use it in the lab but if you are in the field sometimes uh, you don't have any stand to place the phone sometimes you don't have any uh, foundation basis to make this uh, measurement so I'll show you with all the um, all, all the equipment hand-on equipment which I have how to do it very quickly and efficiently also another question we, which we have it's about the measurement of uh, leaf area of quite long leaves as you see for example this cornice has very long leaf but I will show you how to do it effectively so, uh, for example, I have this backpack and uh, this is actually everything which I have. I also have this glass. I have my phone in it just to keep it uh, in safe conditions. And also I need to have my scissors because scissors are important if you have long leaves. It's one of the way how you can um, cut them and make them smaller and then use PTO for them. In this case we have very long leaf so I will just cut it in shorter pieces and so on and so forth so I will do oh no this is not a very good cut but three of them or four of them and then what I do this is my scissors I put them back into the backpack the backpack will be my basis so now what I have I have this stand which is a simple simple uh, glass plastic glass then I need to do the measurement so I switch on my PTO yes here we have our PTO then I press leaf area meter now I need to calibrate the camera so I place the phone on the glass to uh, have the same haze for each measurement then I press the button measure and now I place my calibration pad here yes camera is calibrated then I turn it and have my white um, white area this is the first piece, I save the measurement, this is the second piece, I save the measurement, mm. yes it is, this is the third piece, again here we are, and the fourth one, yes. So and we can continue until we will finish all the leaf and then I close the session and we see that we have our average number of leaves which is for uh, average uh, leaf area of all these uh, four leaves, uh, pieces of uh, leaf. Also we can see the sum of total leaf measurements and below there is a list of each leaf and area and you can see the photo of it and you can export it to PDF and share with any of your colleagues. Yes, finally we can see this session in the report which is includes all the measurements made in the latest time. I hope this video was helpful to you and now you will use PTO Pro better and in a uh, most productive way. If you have any other questions how to use components of PTO Pro most effectively, you can ask us either below this video, leave the comment or send us an email and we will answer your questions in the shortest time. See you soon!